do. Like, what is it? They showed an end. Um, yeah, I was about to say, um, if you play Pokemon, Parasect. Yeah. It's, he is the living definition of that in Pokemon. Yes. Except that he's the infector, not infected. No, he's the infected. Is he the infected? Parasect has a mushroom that has grown over his brain to the point where it possesses his body. Oh. That is what Parasect is. Oh. But no, um, what I remember reading about it was like, it primarily takes over slugs and snails, which brainwashes them to walk to the edge of leaves so that birds can eat them. And then when they, the slug or snail is digested by the bird, the process for the fungal infection is spreading. Into the bird. Not, no, not into the bird. It becomes completed. Mm -hmm. And that's when the bird poops it out and there's more spores because it successfully breeded in the proper climate of the stomach of the bird. No, no, that's... Not breeded, but like... No, I, no, I don't think that's cordyceps. I think that's uh, something else. No, it, it's, it's a mushroom. It's a... Um, I, I don't know if it's... Specifically, a cordyceps, but it's a fungal virus that takes over the brain of snails and slugs. Too. No, no, cordyceps. What it does is it infects the brain. It starts the thing. It infects the brain of the host, and then it gives them the brain instructions to go to the highest point it can. So they showed it what it did with an ant, where it took an ant's mind over, made it go up to a, the tallest uh, blade of grass it can clamp onto that grass so that way it's securely locked and then it killed it and then it grew on the inside of its yeah, head. Yeah, I saw that and one too. That's cordyceps. I think you're thinking of uh, there's another fungal infection that does. Actually, there's a few fungal infections and parasite infections that do that. Like, what is it? There's a... Uh, a... I think it's called fireworm. But it has an actual, like, name, but locals call it fireworm, where it can infect humans, and what it does is it makes the feet of a human hot, so that way they put their leg into water. Once they put their leg into water, it actually pokes its head out, and releases its spores into the water, so that way someone else can digest it further down the line. It's really resilient, that, uh... Fire. So in order to get rid of it, really, you'd have to do an isolated thing in water so that it doesn't spread. Well, no, to get rid of it, it still stays alive when it spreads its thing. It just moves when it's breeding. It goes down to your leg, and then when it's in uh, dormant mode, it goes back into your like muscles and starts eating that away. So, and but it doesn't go hot. It just hides there in the muscle fibers. And then when it breathes, that's when it makes your leg hot to make you want to cool yourself off in water. It's the same with, um, what is it, the, uh, I forget what, it, again, I forget what it's called, but it's local name. It not looked like a horse. Such hunter. low health. Yeah, you need that health. But there's none around right now. Hit some of those. I'm going to try it. Huh. Nothing. And there's a, a parasite that. It infects a lot of like grasshoppers and crickets, and a lot of prey mantises. Where oh what, hello down there. It, oh, that's why do they have AT-ATs on here? Unless it was like to be deployed. They probably are. Probably. Anyhow, I can't. Yeah, I was, can't it, it's a uh, it's a parasite that looks like a horse's hair. And what it does is it, when it infects the host, it basically goes around the inside of the uh, exoskeleton in a coil. Oh, I think I've seen that. Like, then, I, I think I've seen a praying mantis that was dead and like... And, and then you see it just It, it just like out comes it. out and it's like this long ass string. Yeah, yeah, that's it. It's, it looks oh, like I, I don't here. like that room right now. No. Oh, yeah. There's a ton of them. There's, um... One that can get you can get from like uh, infected dirt, huh. nematodes. Huh. It's nematodes. Oh, up there! Do you see that? Huh. I get up there. Uh, or maybe you have to build a platform out of those things to do that jump. Huh. Oh. How would you? Build? Well, That's if you stupid. lift something up and then let it go, and then no, but I mean like that—that that would be a stupid thing to do. Like, oh yeah, you have to build something in this game. As soon as it lets itself go. Just enough to be able to get that jump. Aw. Oh. 
don't think you can really build stuff that high because you can't lift, you can't change how high you lift something. No, but you can. So it'll, this is as high as I can get something piled up. That's not quite high enough. Mm, hold on, take a look up. Maybe there's like some place you're supposed to go up and then circle around. And it's not like an RPG where he grabs the ledge. Mm, no. Nope, there's it, nothing but around. there is, look, there's like a room over there. Maybe at some point you'll go not up. A, it's not a room. Point. It isn't? It looks like a ledge sometime. I don't think so. Oh, well. Waste of time. Let's move on. I got like one health though. I'm gonna die the moment I walk in that room. So you yeah, the uh, cordyceps. If you ever saw that uh, video on uh, YouTube from uh, Planet Earth. I need a. F there better be health over here. If not, I'm so screwed. You're screwed. <laughs> they have none of that. Well, luckily I'm in this room, so hopefully that means it's safe there. Or not, maybe. I'm screwed. It, that uh, video of cordyceps. Every cordyceps is specialized. So, there's a ton of variants, but each variant can only infect one kind of. Uh, animal. Wait, is there something? No. Nope. There is nothing. Like, literally, I cannot jump up there. I guess it's there to taunt you. Or maybe you're at, like, some kind of jump or something like that. There's no force jump, is there? No, not that I'm aware of. Can I pile one more, maybe, on that thing over there? Or is this just getting knocked off? I think that would have worked. It was about there. No, it's just pushing off the first one. It'll drop nicely. Use. Just make a pile. Just make a pile as high as I possibly can. That might actually work. One more. Just need one more, and that will be yours. Nope. It, it, it pushed me because I touched the rail by, like, a pixel. It pushed me to the side because it's like, no, you're a pixel on the rail. Nope, nope, too much. Oh, there we go. Yeah, yeah see, that's not a room. Oh, I thought it was an overlook. That better be, like, the greatest holocron of all time. Jedi Necronomicon. Yeah! We can take him. He only has lightning. He, has... he only has the forces of nature. He has the cosmics un cosmic unbound at his command. He can only do what our supreme leader Palpatine can do. Oh, I see guys flying in. Oh, no. I don't like that. Well, you have to kill all these guys, so... I know. I'm just coming over here to pick this up. I'm just gonna do a turkey shoot on them. What happened? I threw it and it just stopped. <laughs> it's like, nope. Oh my Whoa, that hurt. Yeah, these guys hurt. They, they really hurt. This is why I remember the Death Star being like, this is like the final level. I understand that. But the ramp up of difficulty between the last level and this one is just way too high. Well, you yeah. know. Like, it should not have changed this much to the point where I'm fighting, like, four impossible-to-kill stormtroopers. Yeah, jet troopers. They are so hard to kill, though. They, mm -hmm. they have, like, unlimited health. And you four more. I, Any of them dead? I don't... Maybe one? There was four to begin with. Yeah. But they do start out with... They don't get their health back when they die. That's mm -hmm. what makes this game super easy. <laughs> Just wear them out by pure brick. Not all four of them are still dead. Why are you hitting those barrels? Does it make sense? No, they're my lightning's attracted to that. Yeah. He's dead! There's one left. Oh no, never mind, he's zero left. The zero left. You know, let's see, is there 
Is there any force jump thing? I don't think there is. Oh! It threw one at us. We were just talking about you, ATST. Hey, it's been a while since we killed one of you. I mean, to either you or a Rancor that's gonna show up. Oh man, I'm trying to stay up there. You could use force lightning at the same time. Like you can to an extent, but then it it doesn't always last long. Or it's like it's like two seconds because it takes the animation to throw. Yeah. Instead of like just up here constant. Oh, here we go. Oh, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> like, yeah, there we go. Yeah. And then stop when it comes back. Dr. Ball, who is you? You're under arrest, just try it. <laughs> Interesting. Do tell me more. The ones with the little poker stick, don't die. Just don't die. Hey, look, he died. Finally. He lived like three lives longer than the guy that came after him. The other guy was just a normal schmuck. It's 20 How dare you talk about my stormtroopers like that? They're garbage. They can't shoot anything. They couldn't hit Luke with a door partially open while he was doing a pendulum swing in line with their blasters. They can hit the broad side of the barn with a pie. They couldn't hit a white whale on a black background. Have you heard... I, I just heard about this, I don't know how old it is. Have you heard of something called blue whaling? No. Apparently it's this thing like kids are doing these days, like ten year olds and stuff to be cool. Where you tell people you're doing a blue whale and what they do is they give you a list of stuff that you have to do. They'll give you like everyone that you tell will give you like something like that. And you have to do all these things, and after you've done them all, like a blue whale that gets beached, you have to commit suicide. That's stupid. Yep. Because every, some people say, theorize that blue whales beach themselves just because they want to die. Like, they do that on purpose, like that's their form of suicide. Uh, uh, so they call it blue whaling because apparently you're supposed to get like a bucket list that other people decide for you. And after doing that, you commit suicide. And so what happens if people just don't care? They give you a uh, list of like, go chew some gum, go eat some cereal. Well, then you go do that, and then apparently you commit suicide at the end. Alright, well. And like, you know. Go ahead. I'm, I don't, I don't condone suicide. I don't suicide condone, condone suicide in the slightest bit either. But this is just taking it to a whole new stupid level. Well, keep in mind, before the latest craze of like, fidget, fidget spinners, it was to break your own thumb. Was a thing. Yeah, that, that was a thing. It was a thing where people learned how to rip the tendon, uh, tendon in your Isn't thumb. Isn't it like something like that? You do this and then you just crack yeah, it. Yeah, you go like that and then you have to go super far fast forward and it extends the oh, ligament so stupid. beyond what it should. So it also sounds so painful. Like, who would do that? Well, the internet. That's true. The internet it has. But, like, I've also, seen. these are kids that are doing it. Like, yeah, but kids are stupid. But, like, why would you. You know that ends your life. Like,. Why would you commit suicide? Like, you know that. And you're doing it for such a stupid little list that your friends gave you. And if they were your real friends, they wouldn't have given you a fucking list. <laughs> They're like, well, you've done everything you can do at the age of ten. Yeah. I guess it's time to end it. I guess my prime years are done. <laughs> yeah, everything's downhill from here at ten. Um, 
So my coworker was telling me about it. He said he read it on the news or something, and this was like last month that he told me. Mm. But um, when I heard that, I'm like, well, what if someone like is just an asshole and he's like, oh, I want you to add. Oh, I'm dead. I want you to add to your list. Um, kill myself. Then like you can't complete the list because in order to complete the list, you have to kill yourself. But you don't complete the list until you finished everything on the list and then end up killing yourself. Yeah, exactly. So. Unless he leaves that as the last thing. No, even if you leave it as the last thing, you would kill yourself, and then your list would finally be done, so you would have to kill yourself. He's like, you can't kill yourself twice. Yeah, so you're you're screwed if someone gives you that choice. What if? And also, what if the last person says, you know, don't kill yourself? Well, then there you go. But then you can't complete the list because you can't kill yourself at the end. Okay, well, I guess we're just going to wait until... Uh, old there, age sets in. There's just so many problems with the list, though. Like, the oh, only way you could technically do it is if you got someone that else that, to kill you. Okay, the fact that that Ooh, list exists is a problem. Oh, here we go. Yeah. You will be interrogated. Tortured. You will. Give me the names of your friends and your allies. And then you will die. Our deaths will only rally others. I love how there's health in the back of the scenes. <laughs> so we'll crush any dissent. There may be a rebellion yet. Lord Vader. Dear Vader. I need to go that. So I'll never be able to change my lightsaber. Mm-mm. This is it. Squinty eyes. Darth Vader has a weird stance when he's done slashing his own sword. Oh, you mean with that full, like, horse stance? Yeah. 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 He's just like, yeah, strut my stuff. This is how you twerk it. But keep in mind, remember Obi Wan in Episode Three. Actually, no, in Episode Two and Three, he's got this like two finger point at you stance that he does. If you remember what that looked like, where he's like, "Never defeat me." Man, Darth Vader is actually pretty good. Like he, he <laughs> no, no, I mean like. How much effort you actually have to push into button mashing for him? It's just like that one dark trooper guy that we fought. Uh, not trooper. Um, the shadow guard. Shadow guard. Yeah, that guy had needed some button mashing, like Mario Party style button mashing. Let's see your fate. This isn't over yet, Vader. But other than that, like he's not hard to inflict damage on. It's just he's got a lot of health, so the damage you inflict doesn't look like a lot. No, you gotta keep going at it. He's one that needs pure attrition. Yeah. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Darth Vader is the one being choked this time. <laughs> Oh, oh, uh, oh, it's, it's floor. It's, force. it's floor. <laughs> he can't find- oh shit! <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. Can I move this statue on him? Apparently not. No, but you can go shoot lightning for it. It's made of copper. Yeah, it's made of copper. Oh, wait, he won that one? Yeah, looks like it's- Okay. Don't get too you, much of that. You forgot that that was floor, didn't you? <laughs> Yeah. No, no, I knew it was floor, but when he hit you with the uh, lightsaber, that did a lot more damage than you're doing to him. Well, yeah, because he's got, like, fucking health up the wazoo. Uh, yeah. That is usually where you store my health. Oh, that's where you store your health, too? So do I. I'm, I'm guessing, yeah, that's what I was guessing. He's supposed to be super weak to lightning. Uh... Well, technically that suits the only I, thing I just want to force life. throw him. I want to see him being forced throw. Like, like a little break though. Uh, no. But he breaks out of him so quickly. You asthmatic freak. He's not really asthmatic, he just has 
crippled one the bare lungs. But he had to breathe in sulfurous fumes. From while a, bleeding. Uh, while bleeding. While dismembered three times. That is true, he lost a lot of members that day. Well, I don't know if Obi Wan cut that part off, but ha! We will not have any Skywalker Juniors. Oh, we will, because he knows about the kids. But I mean, he learned about the kids after the fact. He thought he killed them. You are my brother! Destroy your father, and now I will destroy you. You were, you were the chosen not one! this time, Vader. You're about to bring Bowie to the Force, and I'll leave it in ruins. Did it not change the button? Was it just circle the entire time? Mm, yeah, circle the entire time. If that secondary change, it's always too refreshing. Oh, just pick a random button each time. You killed my father! No, I am your father! What? What? <laughs> no, too soon. No, wrong son, wrong son! <laughs> Stepson! Dark side. 